Stop. Don't touch Just me. For one second. Don't touch me. Okay. This is my space look, of energy. Look. Oh, it's that time of the month. And I film five videos a week, so we just can't escape it, avoid it, pretend it doesn't happen. At some point, at some point, I can't talk either. Oh my god, you guys, I have the worst cramps in the universe. I have had the day from hell. Actually, I think I was really having an off day last Wednesday as well. I was over in Beverly Hills having a very like, yay, Beverly Hills day, like searching for makeup for WTF. And I got sucked in, you know, by a simple, hello, how are you? Do you like face masks? And I'm like, of course I do. I was at Barney's and uh, the lady started chatting with me about this mask called the Problem Solver. And just the idea of it really grabbed my attention. You can purchase this separate little bowl which actually why did I purchase this for $44 I could have just used a bowl that I already own but I was like we're going big WTF let's do this you actually activate the powder with a little bit of water and you blend it and it turns into a soft mousse and then you apply this to the skin you wait 45 minutes you rinse it off and boom you are like problem solved you get a ton of product like you get a lot in here and because you're making just like a little bit at a time and you, oh, 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 hocus pocus magic. Do we see that? Yes. Cinnamon, a little bit cinnamony, like clove cigarettes, kind of. I don't know what those smell like. Why would I? Um, I'm going to get all sorts of good and cute. And we're going to, oh, oh. I'm going to get my headband on. Oh my God, Lululemon is like not joking with these headbands. Holy crap. Do I just have like a large head? Now we're going to get the hair up. Ignore my big ears. I know you guys don't need to remind me in the comment section. I already know. I already know. Well, now that I feel extra special cute, let's take off my makeup. Starting with the lashes, <laughs> boom, they're gone. Um, okay, I get in a really strange mood by the end of the day. It's like all of my energy has been just like thrown out. And then what is left is this like weird, like let's make everything funny, even if it's not that funny. So I am going to take my Bioderma. This is the purifying cleansing solution. And I'm just taking a cotton round and we're going to remove the makeup just kind of let it sit here for a second. Let me share some story time with you. Um, I bled through my pants at the nail salon today. That was fun. Uh, thank you, Mother Nature. I was not prepared. It was horrible. I felt like I was in a tampon commercial. <laughs> Can somebody please tell me in the comments section that this has happened to you as well and that I am not totally alone because I literally felt like crying. It was awful actually it was horrible i was wearing like light baby blue denim I, I literally it was like a moment i felt like i was in a movie or something like oh my god get me to my car so i could definitely use some pampering you know the cramps the embarrassing situation what i'm planning on doing because this mask is a 45 minute long mask is I'm going to apply this and then I'm totally kicking back and watching The Bachelor. Now I am going to mix up my magical mask mousse and apply that and we will go from there. Okay, so it says to mix equal parts of the powder with equal parts water. Ooh, it's making interesting noises. I think this is correct. It looks a little weird. It's foaming, foamy-ish. Okay, so I'm just gonna apply this to my face. That's just what it says to do, so. Oh, oh God, is it supposed to do that? Eh. Oh. And I don't think I made it thick enough. It says equal parts water to this stuff. No, don't do that. I think you only need a little bit of water. I feel like I am wiping baby poo all over my face right now.
My milkshake brings all the boys to the yard, and they're like, mm-hmm, mm-hmm, no, no, no. What the effing hell? I hate this mask already. What is this? This is too much work. I'm really kind of annoyed because I'm wearing like my favorite sweatshirt and a pair of really cute pajama pants and I just got mask crap like all over me. Is this just like the day of ruining my pants? I don't know. Um, all right, so I am going to go and watch The Bachelor and chill with my face mask on. Um, but before I do that, I do want to give you a little bit more information on this. So this overachiever superstar is crafted by hand with the earth's purest ingredients. So something that you're paying for with this mask, which I don't think I even said how much it was. This mask is $90, a $90 mask. But again, you do get a ton of stuff in here. You get eight and a half ounces of product. So I think that you could use this a lot. Expect a slightly hot and tingling sensation. Rinse and follow with the youth do, which I didn't purchase because I have other night creams that I will use. Um, this is a certified organic mask, a jet black fusion of antioxidant rich cacao, healing bamboo charcoal, soil nutrients, salts, and exotic warming spices. Go deep on a mission to reveal your most radiant self. Um, basically, it's going to do a lot of really incredible things to tighten your pores, to make you more radiant, and this says that it activates on contact with water, only releasing its magic at the exact moment of use. So you can expect full potency every time, which I do think that's pretty cool, that the ingredients are going to stay really effective instead of kind of getting old in a jar that's continuing to hit air every time you open it and whatnot. However, I need to get better at not like overusing the product. It says equal parts. No, it turned it into like watery, not foamy. It's 1035 right now. And yeah, I will check in as soon as I am ready to take the situation off and I will let you know how the whole experience went down. And if this is worth 90 bucks or if it is just not something that you should spend your money on. All right, I'll be back in just a minute. This tingles. It kind of feels like I'm in front of a heater. It's a very interesting sensation. Um, my cameraman, James, is also wearing a mask. I don't want to laugh too hard and like crackle everything, but um, is yours burning? Yes. Puka's is burning too, apparently. I want to make out. Do it. It burns my lips. Just cheek hug me. <laughs> Wait, no, press your cheek on me. Give me some extra mask. Okay. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. Wow. Hey, you took my mask. I did, actually. Do you want some more? I'll go get some more. Okay, because I made lots. Twins. Twinning. Are you having a hard time talking to me? I'm having a very hard time talking, but my okay. face doesn't my face doesn't burn anymore. My face feels very firm, but I don't want to crack it so much. So I'm gonna take it off now. Okay, so the burning, tingling sensation does go away, and now I feel really just like just like so firm. So I'm hoping I'm gonna take this off and my skin will feel really just detoxified and firm. I just have a little rag in front of me. Normally I would do this at the sink, but Comes off pretty quick, huh? I'm actually gonna get up and go actually like rinse my face off because I can feel, because I just, I need to do that. I'll be right back. I think I like it. Okay, so I am doing the rest of my nighttime skincare routine because typically when I mask, I will cleanse, remove makeup, and then I will mask and then go into my toner, which I just did, which is the Fetomir. Um, I'll go marine. I've been using, look how much I've used of this one. This is a really good toner. I will link below the other items that I used as well. I'm using the Genifique Advanced Concentrate as my serum. I really enjoy that. 
And then I just started trying this one out, but so far I really love it. This is from Kiehl's. This is the Ultra Facial Deep Moisture Balm because my skin is a little bit crazy right now and needs the extra hydration. And this is doing a really nice job without making me break out or aggravating things or being too heavy, even though, can we see how like intense that is? Just feels so nice. I do feel like this firmed my face a lot. I know you guys know I'm all about the firming. I also feel like it does exfoliate when you rinse it off. It is very granular. That's why I had to actually go to the sink to make sure I got everything off. And my skin is feeling really nice right now. I am gonna keep using it. I think that I definitely would not buy the brush or the bowl. What was I thinking? I don't even understand. I mean, the $90 mask is gonna last you a long time. Use a bowl at home, use an old foundation brush. You don't need that bowl that is $40. Ridiculous, that is ridiculous. But the ingredient listing and the amount of product you get in here and um, the experience of having it dry for 45 minutes and having it really firm and tingle, I think is really nice. So I did enjoy it. I give it a thumbs up. My first impression is, yay, I'm going to use this again. I really like that on the bottom, you have this little sticker that says that it was made fresh and it says um, October of 2015. I like that because then you know it hasn't been sitting on a shelf for a year and the ingredients are still, you know, they're active, they're new, it's not an old product. I will keep you updated and I'm curious also to see how long this lasts because you do get so much. So there you have it. I hope you guys enjoyed a WTF that was skincare based. Let me know if you have other skincare or body items or really anything beauty related that you want me to put to the test that maybe is a little bit crazy expensive. Um, it doesn't have to just be makeup, so leave your requests in the comments section. I hope you guys are having a good one. I am off to bed. And uh, if you're watching this at night and off to bed, sweet dreams. If you're watching this during the day, have a wonderful day and I will see you in my next video. Mwah.